back here in the hotel after a year and they're open already like a uh, half a year or so. Uh, I'm gonna check it out and see what it looks like. Uh, constructions are done and so. stuff. Um, I'm not sure if I have access right now but uh, I'm trying to get through uh, the main entrance and see if they uh, allow visitors to or just uh, if you don't live there trying to get in and see uh, yeah, if I let anybody in. We got in. So we got in here like we got to pay we had to pay this guy like uh, 50 RMB which is like a 8 US dollar to get in. I don't know what he does but that's the only way to get in so uh, we got in for 50 RMB so anyways I think he's like um, one of the security guards who's making a few bucks. Um, if we didn't get in I'll probably report this guy to the police I don't know he can scam shit but I got in so uh, let's take a look. So here we go. This is a uh, Quarry Hotel Part Three. Um, it's completed. Uh, it's been a year ago since I've been here. That looks stunning. Okay. I don't think we can get in like inside the uh, the actual hotel inside. I think it's just like from the outside perimeters. Just walk around it. Uh, so this is the inside, there's a cafe and uh, lobby lounge and stuff. Um, yeah, this is it. Um, I'm gonna fly my drone a little bit. I don't think we can get access downstairs, but uh, just from the outside. Just take a look, maybe later we can get access. This, this is the viewing platform here. We can get to the uh, balcony section. So we pretend as a guest and then made it through the uh, uh, the bottom of this uh, building here at the balcony uh, at the base uh, it's pretty cool uh, it's like a spectacle here I mean I don't think a lot of people live here but they just come here to, to uh, check out this building here this hotel so it's very interesting oh, this is like um, one of the restaurants here all the rich people are. <laughs> and let me walk towards the uh, towards the uh, uh, viewing platform here outside. Um, surrounded by these rocks here and stuff. And earlier, 
I will stop at the uh, viewing platform up upstairs here. So you can see there's, they have, I think they have helicopters flying around here. So it will be like kind of dangerous to fly my drone here, but I'll, I'll be careful. So I think there, there's a helipad upstairs, so you can land a helicopter actually upstairs, but I uh, have to be careful. Um, so they have these ropes here and stuff, so this is for rock climbing. I'm not sure if you can see it. So they have these orange ropes in the back. Uh, so they're made for rock climbing here. Uh, it's amazing. Oh, can we get in here? Can we, can we take a look here? I'm trying to sneak in the uh, swimming pool area here. Let's just see what it looks like. So inside is the swimming pool here. The design is really nice here. Really nice design here. This is the gym is relatively small, so uh, for this kind of hotel, it's like really small here. So we're here uh, on the. Um, Basement floor. I think of, there's like like a little aquarium here. Um, I think it's just a restaurant here. Uh, I think it's for uh, meeting room purposes. See the scale model here. So we're here at the uh, lobby here. We got, I don't know. Yeah, it has all these layers here. It looks like really, really nice. You just walk around them. Oh, I think they didn't turn on. There's a light show here. I think on this thing here, it looks pretty cool. But uh, it's not. They don't turn this on until the evening. So, so we're outside of the hotel here, and um, I asked one of the staff earlier how much it costs. The most expensive rooms. He told me 180k, which is about 30,000 US dollar. I was like shocked. You can't be. I checked the website. It's only uh, 30,000 RMB, which is about $5,000. That's about right. So I confirmed this again with the uh, uh, front desk staff. Asked them how much it costs, about $5,000. Uh, the uh, most expensive uh, underwater rooms. But the average room is about you know, 3,000 RMB, which is about 500 US dollars. So yeah, that's the average range you have to pay. But the underwater we can get access to because um, it's sold out for 30,000 RMB, $5,000 per night, okay?